dinner time, guys. Mmm. Dinner time. All right. We're doing something fun. We're taking a uh, we're taking a piece of chicken that everyone has cooked, a chicken thigh, and we are going to elevate that cook a lot. So what I'm going to do is we're going to put some pepper jack cheese inside the chicken thigh. Then we're going to wrap it in bacon, and then we're going to put it on our Rectech RT1250 until we reach that internal temperature of 170 degrees. I like to go a little more on my uh, internal temp on chicken thighs just because that's what I like to do. All right, so I'm gonna go through this pretty quick. So it's really easy. That's it, it's just really easy. And by the way, if you don't know who I am, I'm Ty Sherrill. I'm your official backyard ambassador for Rectech. And we're gonna get to it. Get you a nice sharp knife. If you don't have a Dow Strong, then you need to come to my barbecue class that I'm having because Dow Strong sponsors that class along with Rec Tech and 8 Elite Light Lager. Um, so information will be on Instagram or Facebook or something. All right, big old knife to do that. I'm gonna wrap one, just so you know. Man, the flies are out, summertime. I'm just gonna show you how, how we do this here. So I've got chicken thighs, bacon, and some pepper jack cheese. And we are going to get it. It's, it's easier if you use a block is what I'm going to do with the block. Open your chicken up like so. We're going to cut off a piece of the block. I almost ate that fly. We're going to put that cheese right in the middle like that. We're going to close it up like a sandwich. And once we have the cheese in the middle of that thigh, I need a clean hand. We are gonna go over the thigh with Chef Greg's four letter rub from Rectech. Make sure you go to rectech.com. Get the rub bundle, guys. This, the whole rub bundle, for what you pay for the entire bundle, it's a steal compared to if you were to buy a rub from somebody else one at a time. So this rub is always my go-to base layer for chicken, burgers, whatever. Uh, it's the four letter rub. I'm gonna go over it. Might as well do the inside too. Then I'm gonna go over it with uh, the honey rib rub from Rectech. It's also in that bundle. Get a piece of bacon. And I'm gonna take this bacon and I'm just going to wrap it around like so. I don't like, you can put a toothpick if you want to. I don't like putting toothpicks in my food. I just, I don't know, it's not something I do. So I put the bottom of the, uh, of the bacon, I put the, the ends of the bacon on the bottom. There we go. Now, got that done. We're gonna take that rib rub again and we're gonna go over the chicken thigh one more time. Season it all up. Boom. And that is it. It, it took like five seconds. Maybe a little longer than five seconds, but it was, it was pretty close. So now, we have that set at 325. We're gonna take our chicken thighs. We're gonna put them on the top rack. I'll go ahead and put this on there so you can see it. If you wanna follow me over there. We're gonna take our chicken thigh. Then I'm gonna go right here. I'm sorry, it's 350, not 325. If you want a longer cook, it'll take you about two and a half hours if you do it at 250 to get more smoke on the chicken. It's dinner time, I'm trying to speed things up. I want it at 350. So depending on what your situation is, if you have the time, do it at 250. If you're in a little bit of a hurry like I am, 350 works just fine. So I'm gonna finish making these up. We're gonna put them on there, then we're gonna pull them off and we're gonna cut through some amazing chicken thighs. We'll see you guys in a few minutes. Oh, there we go. 170, perfect. Let's take that guy off. There 
That looks pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. Cheese and chicken. Let's see what this is about. Bacon, some cheese, and a chicken thigh. Oh, I'm losing cheese. Mm-hmm. All right, I better get the other ones off of here because I know everybody's hungry. So we will see you guys in the next video. Cheers.